Hi guys. Uh, so, I don't have much time to record, but I'm staying in the PU chat, and hopefully that's not bothering you. But basically, I wanna, I wanna try something different. I wanna, like, so here's the thing. I started the channel to share PU stuff, mostly, because you know what I am? I'm a PU player. And you know how many other YouTubers play PU? I mean, the Crit Magnet did some. He's dead. Fufu does some. He's act like I'm talking about viable teams, not total bullshit. Like, like the I I don't fucking know. Like you, you see YouTubers who pick up Pachirisu and whatever. But it, it was like Fufu and the Crit Magnet. That's about it. Uh, so you know that that was my thing. But I've really been neglecting PU. And I definitely want to do more with it because there's just so little coverage that isn't awful. So I want to try Mondays with PU. Now, keep in mind, there's absolutely no way I'm going to keep to a Monday. But if I can just get myself uploading PU once a week, hopefully, you know, more PU. That's, ba that's basically the idea. So every Monday I'll be bringing some kind of PU content. That's going to be a thing. It's obviously, I'm obviously not going to actually be able to keep myself to Monday. You know, I'm not, but Sunday is the day I normally don't work, so that's a plus, and I'm, I'm going to try to keep myself to it. So, it might be a replay, it might be seasonal, it might be whatever, but today I have a team, I built this this morning, because Dundee's was like, Megazard, you better build something, so it's around Specs Mr. Mind plus Machoke, and I'm just going to ladder, just... Give me the dick. I'm I'm ready to see it, and I'm spending Mondays in P in the P room. Uh, like I said, uh, I, I would I would leave, but I as a moderator, I kind of feel I ha I have the feeling of responsibility that there's only two off like who aren't AFK right now, and I'm one of them, so I don't want to go. So I hope that doesn't know you guys. I hope I can get a game. If, 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 like, the first of my new thing is just me not getting game, that's the first episode, it's just me staring at a loading screen, I'm gonna flip my shit and never do it. Um. Okay. So, we have a guy named after a location from the anime with a meganium. That is so quintessentially pew ladder. It just brings a tear to my eye. <laughs> anyway, if I get rocks up, Lapras, I didn't really know what to run, so I just ran subtoxic, because fucking I don't know. Uh, Lapras can kind of run through him. He has a ninja, but I'm just going to lead Soul Rock anyway, because he's more than likely speed pass, because it's ladder. What else are the ninjas doing if not speed passing? Oh, okay, he's choice ban and he crits me, which I lived, and I would have gotten on my stealth rock, at which point I could have pressured the minion. So that crit did matter, and it did, well, I'm 99% sure it mattered, but I don't know calc, so maybe I'm being petty. But I'm pretty sure that mattered, and it really fucked on my game plan. Uh, now I have no rocks, which means I actually will probably lose to that Articuno. Now, fortunately, he did something dumb and went to Luminion, which means I can weaken that. Uh, but I didn't really need Luminion out of the way for anything. Like, okay, don't burn. Like, I have guts, but I don't want to be weakened. Um, I'm 223, so I should be faster, so I'm going to go to Lapras and then sub, unless he clicks Toxic or U-Turn, which would suck, but he doesn't. He, he doesn't. He doesn't. Uh, sub Lapras being basically my game plan. Okay, he's running Ice Beam. Don't run Ice Beam as as the man who wrote the analysis. It's so weak. Ice Beam does like... I think the maximum damage to Quilladin is 30 or something garbage like that. Uh, so he's likely Infiltrator, not Speed Boost, but here's the thing. I'm a Lapras and you're not killing me. That did more than I expected. Shit. Uh, that means he can let something die, come back and kill me, unless I get enough lefties. Metang is a check. I don't know why he didn't go Metang. Uh, can I freeze here? No, but I get off 12%. That's something. That did 40. 
I wasn't sure how much that would do, but I didn't really expect 40. Oh, I am pleasantly surprised. Okay. Uh, he breaks it with Earthquake, and the thing is, Ninjask won't be able to, will not be able to kill me if if I don't sub. I'll be out of range. But if I do sub, he might not kill me. Uh, I don't remember. I just recorded the NU thing. I don't remember how much HP I'm running. This is 64 HP. Um, uh, let's say it is a uh, 64 HP Lapras. Meteor Mash definitely breaking. Earthquake definitely breaking. Hydro Pump back. That is the damn. Okay, so he's max attack, so I will not. So I'm just gonna kill him with a freeze dry. This is this game is going unfortunately because Golem without rocks, Golem is a massive threat to this team. Without rocks, without and without Soul Rock, like what do I do? Uh, hopefully he's not sub Articuno. Oh, I'm faster. Okay, so that means he's max H. He's like max Spadef Articuno, uh, which might not have Hurricane, which means I could sub on that. Oh uh, no, he got me. He got me. He got me good. It's you know he got me good. He did, he did, in fact, get me good. Um, I could go Volibi and Defog, or I could go Machoke and just attack. I think I'm going to get rid of the rocks. Um, I'm really scared, I am honestly scared that I'm going to lose this, like, dumb ladder game, because I really don't want to. Uh, but I'm gonna f oh, of course he's rock polish. Why wouldn't he be rock polish? Wait, why am I roosting? He's gonna do more. Oh, right, no, he's gonna miss. Never mind, okay. Of course he's fucking rock polish, and he misses twice. Uh, the basic reason for foul playing is that this is actually Hidden Power Grass Zeb Striker. So, once I break the sturdy, unless he's spadef, I just oko. As he misses all three, which sucks to be that guy, honestly. But at the same time, he's a Meganium, and I don't feel sorry, because people like you who are shitting up the PU ladder. I'm gonna U-turn expecting his own U-turn in the Meganium. Maybe even Articuno. It was Articuno. Uh, Mr. Mime, click the Mime. He's max Spadef, so Psyshock should be the better hit. That does 48%. Kuno is so bulky. So I can't tell if that's more of a testament to how incredibly bulky and good Articuno is. And it's, you know, it's not used as much as, as good as it is. It's not used that much because Obviously, you gotta remove, remove rocks. It's so good. Uh, but on the other hand, Choice Specs Mr. Mind is a fucking beast. You, you just... You don't switch into this. Your best shot is to have a Ponyard, and then something that can take a Dazzling Gleam like an Arbok, and you win the 50-50. And that is how you deal with this monster. Of course, he's fucking Meganium. Why would he be fucking Meganium? Alright. Alright, let me just knock it off, then start close combating. He didn't even leech seed me, so that's cool. Yay, Meganium. It's a good Pokemon, I swear. Uh, what's stronger? Close combat. As long as it's close combat, he's gonna be in range of Mr. Mime Spec Psyshock. And I don't need this for Articuno, obviously. Uh, he's actually gonna be out of range. I have miscalculated. Um. But he won't be able to kill me. So I can just sigh the shock. Um, as it did 49. Come on, but you're gonna get stalled out. Wait, no, he's protect? Of course he's fucking protect, so he can pee pee stall me. You fucking. Uh, uh, please tell me this isn't happening. Whatever, I'm gonna stall him out. I'm gonna go to Volibi, I'm gonna go right back into Mime, I'm gonna spam Dazzling Gleam, and then I can deal with Articuno and Zeb Striker. That's all I have to- oh, 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 right, he's gonna crit me. Which means I have to go to this thing and overheat, which drops my special attack, which means I'm forced out by Kuno. Oh no, he's at 36%, but okay, seriously, fuck this Meganium. It's, it's like, 
it's a bad mod, but because of this bullshit, it's doing okay, and that's annoying me. I'm already annoyed by, like, the first game in my of the series, of this new series, the first game is just driving me insane. And that is Articuno, and how bulky it is for you boys. The substrike is 50% normal. Fucking 50%. If this wasn't toxic, I might lose. That's... That's dumb. It's stupid. But it is toxic, so I'm not gonna lose. And I'm happy. Because I don't... I don't want to lose, you know? You know? It's just one of those things. One of those things you don't really want to do. Okay. So I get a game just as this one is gonna be over. That's pretty nice. He says, G, G. Um, I'm not gonna respond. I'm not... I'm not... I'm just not okay okay uh, he is no his gleam resist is a nine tail so I'm gonna lead mr. mime with the hope that I'm just gonna wear down the nine tails um, oh right he's gonna T wave me turn one I forgot I forgot that was clearly the play uh, he's gonna light screen now but the meow stick is worn down the thing is I don't really have a great T wave switch in so oh wait this is lightning rod I forgot so I could have switched that in um, I definitely expect him to go nine tails, cause obviously he is a light screen up. I'm clicking dazzling gleam. What else? So I'm gonna click Machoke. But no, he decides to set up reflect. Do I disagree with that play? Yes, but was it gonna be the ladder play? Of course, you need both screens. You have to have both screens. That's what the ladder thinks, like every time. Uh, but I am gonna get my guts. Unfortunately, I get fully paralyzed. Um, Hopefully he's not psychic. He's like yawn or something. That is the standard like analysis, whatever. Um, yeah, psychic would suck because then I'd be weakened. I don't like that. As he goes Altaria, so I at least get to knock off the lefties. I have no idea what Altaria is gonna. What is he gonna do? Dragon Dance? It is Dragon Dance. Okay. Um, you're dead. So nice. Nice. Uh, Machoke. I could be running D-Punch, but I didn't feel like slapping myself in the face and telling myself, you know what, I know it hurts, but it's worth it just to get those wins. No. Uh, he is Gleam, but with that, on the, you need to be Life Orb Gleam for the lure to work, because otherwise I'm not even too good. Uh, that's the problem with Gleam. So I'm gonna go Lapras. I'm just going to high the draw pump. I don't really know what I was going for there because that doesn't make any sense. I mean, you can say like pulse the dark or um, close the combat. I don't know, but high high the draw pump does not make any sense at all. As I crit the Avalog, which is gonna let me to a KO it. I think without with the light screen dropping, I might have been able to to a KO it anyway. But I don't know, and frankly, I don't, I don't really give a fuck. If, if I'm being totally honest with you guys, this is a free sub. As he light screens, he doesn't T wave, that's nice. That's a nice thing. Lapras kind of just wins. Um, this thing kind of, you know, just just wins. What, what does he have? He's a Kadabra that's actually gonna take two Hydro Bumps with the light screen. Okay, I didn't really expect that. He's Calm Mind. As I freeze him. <laughs> Um, in my defense, I was gonna win this game anyway, which sounds like a, a thing an asshole would say, but in my defense, I'm an asshole. So, this is the PU. Next time I'll, br I'll bring you seasonal games. I actually have a round, and I'm, I was supposed to play around round, uh, this week, but the guy never showed, so I might get activity or something, I don't know. As we have Illinois Ducklets, he was talking in the room earlier, he's a Gigalith, so... What can I? What could I possibly expect from a team with the eagle? With? I don't really know. Um, he says, "Good luck, have fun." I'm gonna say, "Have luck, good fun."
But evidently, he doesn't really want to choose a move. Okay, Giglith is the obvious lead. I'm just gonna... Yeah, I'm just gonna trade rocks. Well, I could burn him first. Might as well. Might as well burn him, then go for rocks. You know, rock burn. God, I remember... Oh, he actually went Floatzel. Should've gone for rocks. Should've... Would have. Could have. Uh, Lapras is a very obvious switch here, so... I'm gonna go pivot into Volibi and see what he wants to click. Just just scouting, mind you. Oh, he's Pursuit. Okay, fair enough. You know, Pursuit Floatzel is a cool set, and I have nothing against it at all. Um, I'm just gonna click the free U-turn, because it's a free U-turn, and when you have a free U-turn, you click U-turn. Uh, because I do want rocks in this game. Okay, he goes Stoutland. Even if he's Choice Band Crunch, I should be able to take one. I think, maybe, don't quote me on that, but it's a non-stab 80 base power crunch, and Stoutland is only strong in the sense that Return is a great stab move and it's unresisted, but it's not that strong, so he goes Float, so actually I like Pursuit Float plus Stoutland, because it can weaken this thing, and nothing else, and Soul Rock isn't that common, so I don't know what the point is, but Dual Choice Banders is cool at least. Um, I will again switch out, if he Pursuits that's fine. He doesn't, he waterfalls. He says plus. He says plus. Plus what? I don't know. Um, please don't switch. Please suck my dick, you're a terrible ladder. Oh, he's not choice banned. Non choice banned in pursuit is weak as dicks, and I don't like it. That's just me being honest. It's really weak. Don't don't use it. Just don't. So I have to assume his last move is Aqua Jet, and therefore he can't touch me. If it's Brick Break, I'll cry like a little girl. If it's Low Kick, I'll cry like a smaller girl. I don't know. Uh, if Unless he's Assault Vest, this is killing. Or unless I miss, of course. But hopefully it's not a thing that happens. Uh, it died. Lapras is a cool mon. And Choice Specs Lapras is the set. And it hits even harder and it's hard to switch into. The only reason I didn't have Specs is I was like, I want to use Lapras. I've never used it before. And I needed something to check Floatzel, so Lapras seems good. But I already have Specs mine, so why don't I try Subtoxic? That was basically the idea. I was actually miss. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you know, let's let's click on it. Randomized fire red nuzlocke. I I'm doing one of those. He has 61 subs. Oh my god. He's in it. This man is in a uh, in one of those leagues, and he summarized the Pokemon Direct. Go check the. Mono Dark, fun. Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Alright, uh... I'm just gonna click Soul Rock. Ouch, that was a crit. Okay. Um, let me quick the. Uh, I could keep this with Morning Sun. I don't need it, and therefore I'm gonna play on the edge and sacrifice my switch into his Arbok, my switch into his Stetland, and my switch into his Chadot. I'm just gonna not even recover with it. Uh, but but now I know. Oh, oh, it's still alive, ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen. It is still kicking. Raw Melon is being a nice guy. Come on. There he is. <laughs> See, it just... The magic isn't quite there when you have to go tell the other person. Like, if it was DMT, I guarantee you, like, tennis or rattled snakes or... Maz, I don't know who hangs out in this chat though. Someone would have just like clicked on it if it was DMT. Someone, someone would have linked his channel on their own. But you know what? I'm not DMT. 
Welcome to Life is a Failure. Uh, this is going to be the last game, but it's taking so long. Um, I pranked the bro, though. I, I, it, was, it was just a prank, bro. Don't, don't take it too seriously. Don't time out. If he times out, check me out my channel. I think that'll be pretty perfect. But I'm I'm honestly not. See, I have to upload this tonight because it's already 9:30 on the Monday that I am supposed to upload this. Because I only decided like three minutes before the recording I was gonna do Mondays. So I do need to get this done without editing and stuff. Uh, but he's back. He goes to the Stout Land, which should be to a KO. Sub for sub. Uh, the sad part is I haven't clicked subscribe to the... Oh. Well, that's kind of depressing. I didn't even get the kill. Um, now, the sad part is... He evidently thinks we're in a sub for sub, but I have not clicked the subscribe button. And I'm not clicking it. <laughs> have fun, man. <laughs> I'm an asshole. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. Because I guarantee you, he, he clicked... I, I guarantee you he clicked the sub, and I'm gonna feel really bad. And you know what? If he does, I might sub for him. I encourage all of you to sub to uh, Magmar Seven Eleven. Yeah, Magmar Set Magmar Seven Eleven. See, I would ask what happened to Magmar One Eleven through Magmar Six Eleven, but that would of course mean that there was gonna be a Magmar Nine Eleven, and nobody wants that. Uh, I'm filter. I'm not soundproof, so hopefully I can live this. Ah, nice, okay. That was probably, like, Modest Scarf, because I think Specs would've killed. Because Specs chat up fucking destroys all of these shits. And if Ghosts weren't more common now, and if normals, Normal Resists weren't already required on every single team, and if Specially Defensive Golem wasn't making, like, a massive comeback, I think Specs chat out would be one of the best mons in PU. But it's not because of that. Uh, he's clicking Pursuit. Which I probably die to anyway. Yep, there it is. But because of that little thing that says your opponent's being switched out, um, because of that, he knows I didn't switch out. He knows I predicted him. And all that's important is that I asserted my dominance. Uh, I'm only setting up sub because ditto. Because that way it just be ditto. It's not a problem. Which one sample teams? Which button is sample teams? I don't know. Shout out to Galvia for making an amazing staff intro. Um. Okay, don't forget Stealth Rock. I mean, yes, I, I cannot fault that. Do not forget Stealth Rock. That is an important thing. Because the funny part is about this team, when I first used it, like the very first game I used it to test, uh, I didn't have Stealth Rock. Uh, the Soul Rock was a Scarf Simi Sage. I don't even... I couldn't tell you why, but it was a Scarf Simi Sage, so there you go. I really want this recording to be over by now, but this man's being a fuckhead. And not and not clicking the buttons. You should always click the buttons. So, um, if you enjoyed, drop a like, drop a sub to Magmar711, drop a comment, and, um... I'll just, you know, prove that I won, I guess, because this is over and it's pretty obvious.